Hello, everybody, and welcome to Dot to Dot. And boy, these are some exciting times after the last uh, connection discovery made by Oliver from Oak Island Research and the Antiara schematic. I'll be showing that in just a second. But uh, also, uh, John Stemmer from the Quest of Oak Island podcast channel on YouTube. He also has a Facebook uh, page, which has 70,000 members uh, involved. Some of them are actual people, I believe, on the show. And we're going to be having a live session with him on June 19th at 6 p.m. Eastern Time. And uh, hopefully Oliver will be there. He's in France. He's seven hours ahead of us. So uh, he stays up pretty late. And I think he'll be there. So, and we'll be discussing uh, the, the discoveries that uh, we've made along the way. And we have coined, or basically we have called this theory, the vault theory. And I will give you a little slideshow. This is a preview. Uh, you can pause and look at some of the slides that I've uh, made so far and ask questions when we do our live show. And here we go, of course. <clears throat> this is the Rashvakal map, one of the central theme, central items to this theory. Then, of course, Nolan's Cross. Covered by Fred Noland, 1980. And we have the 1445 distance and its relationship to Nolan's Cross. And we have the functions of Nolan's Cross. And we have the 1445 distances applied where we discover these landmarks on Oak Island. And we have the Endstone and the North Anchors, which are the base part of 1445 distances. And of course, Fred Nolan's survey comes in to confirm some of the points that we discovered. And the distances, the blue line is the 1445 distance. And the 1937 survey, which confirms the money pit. And of course, we move into the other Zena Halpern document, La Formula, and the Marie note, where we find this distance and also the 80 degree angle, which is the extension triangle and there's the extension triangle the 80 degree angle and we find the hole and the valve and then we put it all together and everything is located mostly the hole under the trap door and the valve and the oak hindrance of the money those are the major ones and then we get into the formula, the translation about the instructions on how to get into the vault. And we then got another document, the Deonston document, which really gave a little more credibility to the formula and Kempton cipher. But we also get an additional magnetic declination value for Oak Island, which could tell us a date. And this is set as a heading, but it also could be the top stone distance from the headstone. These are the major instructions from La Formula. And then the discovery also of the 40 foot charcoal mark, which we believe is, which is from the account historical account of the bunny put, the first dig, how they discovered a charcoal layer at 40 feet. Could it be an indicator? Stop here. And then, of course, the Antiar schematic, 
which is very cool. And it gives us step-by-step -step instructions. And here I just uh, correspond the letters from that to that, those landmarks on the Rosh call map. And then the steps that needed to be done. And then this is the vault. I drew this up. It's not that great, but this is the vault closed and this is the vault open. And step G, get into the vault. But we'll be explaining this more. Come see us on the live show at Quest of Oak Island. Subscribe uh, to his channel so you can get uh, the uh, notification that when it's going to be so you won't miss it. Come out and support us and we will be answering questions. All right. Well, thanks for watching and I will talk to you guys later.